Hey, what's going on everybody? Today, to continue on with the series, we have the cheapest analog delay we could find on Timu. So if you haven't seen the series yet so far, I encourage you to go back and look at the other videos. But you can watch them in any order, it doesn't really matter. So, let's, let's get at it. And there we had the ma 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 manual, ma ma manual, so I'm sure that's pretty uh, thorough. And then a uh, bubble wrap pedal with some knobby knobs, a little LED, a push button, gazenta, gazata, the analog delay, and the power. Simple little analog delay. We got time, mix, repeat, self-explanatory. We'll throw everything at noon, put it down on the floor, and we'll give it a try. We'll see how it goes. What could go wrong? All right, so we got the pedal down on the floor, and we'll throw a little uh, blues driver in it and occasionally see how it goes. But right now, the settings are completely at noon. Here's a clean tone for reference. Well, that was a bad idea. Yikes. Um, all right, we'll back the repeat down. It's kind of weird. It sounded like it was stored in the pedal somehow. So that concludes the rundown of that pedal. Um, I kind of feel like that once the repeats got anywhere past really two o'clock, the pedal really became completely unusable. So it's not really something, but it sounded okay in some, some respects. When we had the 
time and the mix all the way at the nine o'clock position and the repeats at noon. It was that really like subtle, it had a little bit of a delay, but it more fattened up that sound. If you remember from my introduction to the pedals where I talked about anywhere between like 30 to 40 milliseconds, it kind of really just fattens up the sound a little bit. So, but overall, I really wasn't impressed with this pedal and it's really the first one that kind of, I don't know. I mean, I probably would futz around with it a little bit, but I know there's definitely better delay pedals out there. You might even be seeing one soon. Hopefully you like the series so far. After all, we still have seven more pedals to get through, but uh, leave a comment down below of what you liked, what you didn't like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. You've been a great audience, and as always, stay tuned.